So today I'm going to get a chance to get out on that new buggy that's that's electric. And Bob Debitz, Buggy Bob, is going to give me a little test drive today. And we're going to get a chance to go out and see what this thing is like. Yeah, and then I'll obviously leave it in park because else the somebody accidentally hits the pedal. It'll start down. again. And then yeah. when I want to go in reverse, just press that. Just wait. So just you know, all you do is just wait. So this is the new electric Tundra buggy, and quite frankly, on top here, when I'm inside the buggy, it looks just pretty much like we used to have with the with the diesel engine buggies. Where there's a difference is here over at the driver's station. So there's this foot pedal and the brake and the gas pedal and this all used to switches have and buttons, more. but it's now all on the LCD, like lots of things electric. But it's pretty much just like what we used to, I used to come up here and actually drive Tundra buggies for Tundra buggy tours. So it's gonna be fun. Doesn't look much different, but it'll be fun to see how it rolls. Guests will come out, uh, and if they're going to, for dinner, they um, they leave at five o'clock, and they go for dinner for six. And then they stay out there, have dinner. There's a bonfire, and then they do the Glen Livets uh, Scotch story, and drink a hundred dollar bottles of Scotch, have a taste of it, and go back in, have dessert. If there's lights, the guests can stay um, and observe the lights. Well, we're coming here to the spot where Frontiers North has their northern lights, kind of uh, expedition, if you will. And uh, we're going to get a chance to meet the gentleman, who, the young man who is now kind of running operations up here. Really a unique individual who is doing an amazing job. can tell these are all batteries along here but this all looks so much different than the days when I was working up here helping to drive these diesel buggies look at this stuff Yeah, so pretty good. She made it out on there before you did, didn't you? It's a little bit like if you push it all the way, it's gonna lock up all four wheels. And then I'm gonna skid down. Yeah, you just gotta learn. It'll it'll let go. I mean, I went slow, but. 